How did your meditation go? Did you find that helped? Was it something that you perhaps like to do a bit more of? Feel free. I find it a really useful practice every day. So we're still talking about handling the overwhelm. And the next thing that I want to talk about is the idea of sometimes walking away from what we're doing. I remember years ago reading in a book, when you feel overwhelmed and you don't know where to start, get up and take the afternoon off. And I was like, what? <laughs> Control freak that I was at the time. It was like, no way am I going to do that. But actually the theory behind this is really, really sound. What it's about is that we can get too into what we're doing. We can get too stressed, we can be too future focused, and we can't, we're not present in the work that we're doing. So in fact, we're incredibly inefficient. The idea of walking away is to walk away to gain perspective, to help us see that actually, perhaps it's not the do all and die all that it could be. In fact, it's just another task, and it will get done. Now, admittedly, I don't take an afternoon off, but I will take five, ten, or even half an hour off and just do something different. Obviously, if you work for yourself, that's easier. But even if you're in a company, you can get up, go to the bathroom, go get a coffee, go chat with somebody. Just get your head out of what you're doing. Because when you get your head out of what you're doing, you get a different perspective on the world. So when you come back to it, you're fresher, you're more focused and you're probably more solution orientated too. So I invite you for the next couple of days when you find yourself kind of going under the water and not being able to find air, get up, walk away, do something different and come back with a new perspective.